Hey guys, welcome back to episode 17 already. And in today's episode, we will be playing the Spanish Cup, the Copa del Rey against C.D. Alaves. Starting 11 will be Mal, Marco Asensio, Alvaro Morata, Vasquez, Isco, Modric, Casemiro in the midfield, Marcelo, Cavajar, Varane, Ramos, and Navas between the pipes here. First game will be played away at C.D. Alaves. Mendy Zorot. Zorotza. I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't even know if that's the real stadium, though. But here we go. All right. Seems easy enough, right? No, that's... Let's try to recycle the play quickly. Guy's not really moving out wide. I've already selected wing rotation Tikitaka already. Morata. We have nobody in the middle, though. Now we got two guys in the middle. Header? Nope. No header. Couldn't get to the ball. No strikes. Okay. Casemiro Asensio. Morata. Ah, I didn't get to Morata. Let's get the ball back here. Isco. Is that a foul? That's nah, just a nick on the on the leg. Nothing too serious. Marcelo. Well, we'll go short this time. Okay, we're gonna go on the right flank now. Carvajal, Modric, Vasquez is open. Cross? No, not open anymore. I thought it was gonna... Okay. That was a that was a pretty fast goal. I wasn't expecting that. Once I saw an opening during the scramble, I just took it. Right here, I was contemplating taking the shot with Vasquez anyways, but no one's guarding Morata. That's a pretty easy look. I'm not sure why he just, just fell flat right there. Okay, he got, okay, never mind. He got tripped up afterwards, after the shot has been made. That's 1-0. We'll take it. Good finish by Alvaro. 1-0 Real Madrid. Isco, Asensio. Ah, Morata is in there. I can't give it to him though. That's a terrible pass. Ramos. And that is already it. What a fast 45 minutes we have here today. 69% possession. Two shots, both on target. 85% pass completion. They have no shots taken against us. So far, so good. Okay. The infamous Mal trio. Could very well be better. We'll see. I don't know. There's a shot. Ooh, good. Shot is blocked. Espinoza. It's a pretty good lob pass. It's a double lob. Good block by Marcelo. Might have been a goal, actually, if he didn't block that. Corner conceded. And I love playing... Actually, there's no need to play man, because they're not going to go short. Oh, my goodness. That could have been a goal right there as well. That's pretty poor marking. By one of the CBs. Actually, I think it was uh, Ramos. Vasquez. Oh, Maratas. No, that's not Murata. Casemiro is through, though. He's going to take it himself. The finesse shot. That felt like a FIFA cheese. That really felt like a FIFA cheese with the with the finesse right there. Bottom left, quickly. Right out of the keeper's reach. One touch bursts ahead of his defender. I'm not sure why Casemiro is so up front, though. I mean, he got the goal. I'm not complaining. But why was he so far up top on the counterattack? I'm going to bring on Kovacic. Casemiro has done well as a holding mid. He's done well defensively too. Modric. Nah, still not there. We still are front three trying to stretch out the defense. But 
With the four back, we really have to just make more passes here. He's open. I could not get to Vasquez. I saw the opening right at the semicircle, right there. A foul was made. Morata looks hurt. The referee does signal the medical staff, which we never get to see, and it's a it's a bit of a tussle. Uh, shouldn't shouldn't be too much of, of a deal. Not not too big of a deal. Isco just tries one right here. Deflected. Keeper clears it out. Modric out. And finally, we're going to bring in Lobato from our youth squad, quote unquote. I think he's actually a real player. But just at a younger age. He's like 16 in this game. Okay, here. I'm going to go short with Vran. Kovacic. See, Kovacic stays inside the circle. You know what I'm saying? He stays inside the circle. Asensio is through. Tries to give to Lobato one touch. Couldn't beat his defender, but does get taken down. Hope he's not injured. Yellow card shown immediately. I think we need to be stretchered again. Yeah. One touch. Tries to evade. Ah. That was a reckless challenge, man. Come on. Isco, one more. One more. Gonna go near post this time. Might be deflected, though. Nope. Doesn't touch the pole. Yeah, too much. Too much. Should have done better. Kovacic. Not much time left here. We could just sit back. But this is Real Madrid. We don't want to sit back, right? Lobat, oh, he couldn't control the ball. Asensio does have the ball. Kicks it back. Maybe I should have taken that one. Kovacic. Hamas. Oh, he misread that play. Vasquez gets back. Is, is, that a, is that a penalty kick? Ref? No? What? What? It's my foul? You've got to be kidding me. Of course it is. Of course it is. Let's get the ball out here. They do have numbers. Uh, we've got two, three guys running. Ooh, that's a date. No, not the. Oh my goodness. Oh my. How did he miss the open net? Net was wide open, literally. It's a great cross. And another great cross. That's a terrible punch out, though. Oh my. What was he doing? What was the keeper doing? And what was this guy thinking? Less than two minutes left here. About a minute now. Five minutes at a time. To the clock. We just got to hold out a little bit longer. And uh, come away with the victory. Away too. Two critical away goals. It's going to be big. It is a two-legged competition uh, tournament. So that is it for the Spanish Cup here. 67% possession. Five shots, three of them on target here. 84% pass completion. In the end, it did take four shots against us, but only two of them on target here. Casemiro is your man to match for hitting the game winning goal. Uh, well, second game winning goal. You know what I mean. He basically sealed the deal. Atletico drew. That's surprising. Barcelona 4-1. Not too surprising. Valencia did lose. Uh, Athletic Club beats, uh, I think it was Ibar. Look at the table here. We're going to be playing, uh, who are we playing here? Villarreal, I think, afterwards. Yeah, it looks like it, if they win. If we both advance, I think Villarreal does have a better chance, though. And we have a two-day break here, going back-to-back -back with more Spanish Cup action here. Stegers has joined Barcelona. We are back at the Santiago Bernabeu, though. Uh, Mal up front again. Kroos coming back. Modric, Casamiro, Cohen, Trau, and Danilo, the fullbacks this time. Pepe replaces Varane. And Kiko Casilla is your man between the pipes for now. We can skip the pregame introductions and go right into the match. All right, so it looks like 
for whatever reason, Alaves is playing ex well, quite defensive. They're not parked the bus defensive, but still more defensive. They're down two goals on aggregate. I'm not sure why that is the case here. That's a free goal, right? No, it's not. Of course it isn't. Starting to threaten to go right now, but just trying to push the defensive line back a little bit. Ooh, one touch. Lucas Vasquez gets, oh, the shot gets blocked. I thought I had them. We thought I scored. Casemiro. Central to Modric, back to Vasquez. But what can he do with the ball? Not much. No space given. Cross. Still got him. Asensio. He's got cutters. Contrao. He can get in. Cross it. Ah, oh, get it. Yes. We got him. Finally broke the defensive line after all this. They literally got like four, five, six, seven guys in the box now. Yeah, six guys in the box. Seven, eight. Eight in the box afterwards. A lucky pick off a poach. A great poaching goal by Vasquez. Just keeps control of the cross. Able to finish top left. And that's 1-0 slowly but surely putting them away. 3-0 aggregate. Closing in the halftime now. About a minute half left. Ramos. That's a dangerous cross. But a more dangerous uh, defender. That's a, Who was he passing to? Santos. And we get a break. A very short break. 73% possession. Four shots. Three of them on target. 88% pass completion. Three crosses. Eight interceptions. One tackle. Only two saves. Wow. Second half. Here we go. Alright. Okay. That's a terrible pass, by the way. Quick counter attack by Alaves. He is not... Uh, Letting up right now. Ooh. Right at the keeper by Santos. Look how fast they initiate the counterattack. Right away, we got one, two, three, four, five. I think six coming in as well here. Danilo. Modric back to Vasquez, but it gets cut off, unfortunately. Gonna bring on Asensio. I'll bring off Asensio for Rodriguez. Hamas. Now they're pretty much all out attack. But it's a bit... I think it's a bit too late actually. I mean we're down 3-0 aggregate. Giving up two away goals as well. So. They essentially need three goals. Oh my goodness. What, what, oh my goodness. How did he not clear that ball? Ramos. They do get one back after, I think, 76, 77 minutes uh, in the second match, second leg. A lot of confusion here. Lofted, well, there's a cross, a low cross. The, cro the, the clearance gets blocked for some, somehow, somewhere, and then that happens, you know? He had a, uh, he had a hand on it, but not good enough here. Gonna bring off Morata for Lobato. For the final duration of this second leg here, we should be able to close them out still. With about 12 minutes left. Going through Hamas. Let's see what we can do here. Nope, nothing. The blocked shot though. Lobato, can he get to it? He does. He does. Passes it to Kroos. He Can he find anybody? No, we can't. Ooh. Was that Casemiro? The back heel. This guy thinks he's Ronaldo. Check it out again here. Does manage to outwork and out hustle the defender here across. It was a decent pass, I mean. I think it's a, that's, a, that's a corner, right? No. Of course not. Mariano Diaz is coming in for Vasquez. Referee tells him to get off the field ASAP. What's funny is that I don't think the time winds down. All right. It's a one-man wrecking crew. Diaz. Cross. He almost he got to the header. A bit too high. Could not keep it down. And shoots it way over the net. 
A decent cross. Decent cross. Yeah. Ooh. Is he gonna cross it? Nope. No, I can't get the ball. We got two, three guys in the box here. Get it out. Okay. Control. Four minutes of added time left here. Push the ball into their half. Well, I think we have numbers, actually. Can we center it? No, we can't. He, he lofted it out. Diaz. Still Diaz. Takes the shot himself here. Oh. He missed a wide open net. <laughs> Lobato. It's a great run. By uh, Diaz, I believe. Yep. Takes it. And it just misses the net completely. It could have been his first Real Madrid goal, but he botched it. He will definitely come to re regret that one. Less than two minutes left of added time. 3-1 aggregate. Will a miracle happen for them? Hamas. Trying to outrun everybody here. Two, three defenders. Still wants to score. They're still hungry. Tries to center it, but... Defense will not allow the ball to get right at Lobato's feet here. Kroos, still pushing. Crosses. No, not there. Five minutes. They're way over time now. Come on. Ref, blow the whistle. Yes. Yes, okay. Don't want to give myself a heart attack, right? Final score is 1-1. 65% possession, 10 shots, 5 on target, 83% pass completion. Six crosses, 22 interceptions, though. Your man of the match is Santos, really? I thought it was Vasquez. I mean, he basically sealed the deal when, at that point, he made it 3 0 aggregate. So it looks like Atletico Madrid will go through. Betty will go through. Athletic Club will go through. Barcelona, of course. Um, Granada defeats Sevilla. ED Blue Burgundy, I think, is a fake team. Real Sociedad go through as well. Looking at the Spanish Cup second round onwards, we are indeed up against, um, sorry, not Villarreal. It's actually Real Sociedad who will be facing in the next round. And between that bracket, it should be easy. We're not playing Barcelona. We're not playing Atletico. Messi wins player world player of the year. It's not too surprising given, given the amount of awards, uh, trophies he's won for Barcelona. An offer is made from Sevilla. World Player of the Year has been announced. World Manager of the Year. Now, who can that be? Who can that be? <clears throat> Messi. Yep. Nothing new about it. Oh, Diego Simone. Simone? Negotiation. Sevilla. How much money are they willing to offer for this guy? 36 million euros. I don't know if he's worth that much money. But it, but again, in today's terms, this guy could easily, could easily fetch you 40, 45 million. In today's football economy, okay? Everybody is getting overpaid. They're getting paid mountains of money, okay? Lobato, he can't really play on a wing. He's pretty much a central, uh, secondary striker, I guess. That's his preferred role. Dribbling 81. 90 speed, 87 explosive power. That's all right. Flexible, maintain formation. You can't really maintain formation. Frontline pressure, that's what I like. You can play wide. He's fairly aggressive. Um, Yeah, I mean, the guy's only like 16 years old in this game. No reason not to try to resign him, right? No reason at all. More negotiation days, okay? Pepe... Contract renewal update. I think Isco had one as well. So let's see if they accept. They we're currently sitting at six spots, so nothing has changed. Carvajal. Yeah, okay. Well, it's, it's failed, apparently. I don't know how much more money this guy wants. Pepe. Yeah, let's just accept. Let's just accept. Ups it to 300 more K. Isco wants one more million for his salary. I guess that's, that's fine. All the money in the world here. I think Bale rejected. Yet again. That's probably his fourth or fifth rejection. Some of them I didn't, even, I didn't even show on screen. So that might have to change. Let's continue to advance the time. Ibar is next. Great. His negotiations have broken down. Well, why would he do that? 
That is it for this episode. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time.